Hi there. Today I'm going to give you some tips on how to make super soft gnocchi in a basil flavored bolognese sauce. Let us start with the potatoes. My first tip, wrap each potato in foil and bake them in the oven until cooked. Good. And now for my second tip, use a tomato strainer to mash the potatoes so as to get a nice soft silky texture. As you can see they come out nicely fine, very fine. And now for my third tip, the flour, which should be about 15% of the weight of the potatoes. Sift the flour to make it more fluffy and to bind together with the potato. It will bind better. Use as much as you need, a little bit at a time, like that. Okay. We now put in all the ingredients. Okay, we put our flour in, not all of it. And now we add the rest. We put a teaspoon of salt, about two tablespoons of parmesan, parmigiano, to give it flavor. One egg yolk. Okay. One eighth of a teaspoon of baking powder, which is about six, uh, zero six um, ml. Okay. Which is my fourth step. And, as to, uh, and lastly, my fifth tip. We put about one hipped teaspoon of butter, which has already been softened. And we had a touch of nutmeg. And we mix everything together. Our dough is now ready. And now we proceed to making our gnocchi. We cut a little bit. You can see the texture. It's nice and soft. Very soft. It's a very nice texture. So we take a little bit of the time and we roll it out. Roll it out. And we cut it small pieces. Depending how big you want your gnocchi. Okay, then we give it a nice shape. Just roll them up a little bit, make it into a ball. Put it here like that. And then you roll it down. And you can see that it comes a nice gnocchi. Okay, our gnocchi are now ready. I'm just going to boil some water now and cook them. Okay, this is how we make our ragu for the gnocchi. We fry a little bit of olive oil. We add on some onions, some carrots, some celery, and a clove of garlic. And we just let it cook for a little bit. Okay, now our sofrito is ready and we add the mince. Okay. It up. And we let it cook. Okay, we now take the garlic out. We put a little bit of salt and pepper to taste, of course. And we have we add our tomato, a peeled tomato which has been previously cut. Okay. We mix nicely. And we let it cook for about 
half an hour. We now cover it and we let it simmer. There you are. Okay, now the water is boiling and I've put a little bit of salt, of, um, of oil in it so that the gnocchi don't stick together. Okay, we wait until they come to the top. Then we take them out. Like that, we put them in our sauce. Okay, gnocchi are cooked. Just turn them, mix them gently. Make sure they don't break. There you are. Look how nice they are. Look how nice with the sugar. We now put a little bit of parmigiano, parmesan cheese. And they're ready to be served. Okay, I know are ready. We put a little bit more of parmigiano, parmesan cheese. There you are. Ready for you to be eaten. If you have enjoyed it, please subscribe to this channel, hit the like button, and please share it. Thank you. Bye.